Hi guys, here's Christian from Game Design Reviews, Game Design Strapbox, and of course our wonderful, wonderful teamwork Monster Hunter podcast show. And uh, I'm here with this game called Ragnarok Odyssey, and I'm going to show you a couple of quests so you have a good feel for how the game feels like. I'm going to this time fight the Orc King, which is basically the quest after the previous quest I recorded, which is which was about killing lots of orcs, and now I'm killing the Orc King. Now is something weird happened? No, I don't want to cancel. I don't just want to do it. I just want to go in and do it. Do it! Right. Alright, so I'm starting here. And, you know, as I said, you know, the monsters are not really, at, at least the monsters I saw so far, they don't really change positions or, or like levels, so... Um, I will be fighting this monster only here and nowhere else. There is a lock-on system and you can actually switch the different body parts, that's kind of pretty neat. Um, especially like for this monster fight, it's actually quite um, quite convenient. Uh, and um, you, there is apparently, at least the game says that, whoa, I'm not doing so well right now. Uh, the game says that um, you can break individual body parts, but uh, I think I managed it not with this monster, but with the next one once. But um, yeah, you have to do a lot of mad damage there, kind of like bullet sponges. Right now, this monster is enraged, or I think it entered like this, like like a second phase. Something I discussed together with Brad Galloway recently in a discussion I recorded. Um, the boss enemies uh, seem to have like multiple levels. Like you, when you do enough damage, they kind of freak out and become stronger and then they freak out once more and become even more stronger so there is like um potential for like um like kind of like rpg like multi-stage battle that's kind of neat i think i thought yes 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 oh jeez i should have i should have avoided this i'm gonna drink some some of this enragement potion i have a potion that makes me um uh, makes my frenzy appear more quickly uh, that's kind of uh, very neat, I think, because I kind of want to go to town with this guy. Whoops. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, key. It was in a combo I wasn't able to avoid. Um, one of the things that I also um, mentioned with Brad is that, um, first of all, there's like a lot of mashing on a monster, so like you get a lot of, they are more like a bullet, bullet sponge kind of thing. And also, um, there is not really a way, at least um, from where I was fighting, maybe later on, uh, when, when I get later in the game, maybe there is like more potential to do so. Uh, but so far I haven't found any items to kind of manipulate the monster anyway, so there, I haven't found any um, flash bombs or something like this. Which is a little bit... I'm gonna go to town now with him, haha! <laughs> take it, take it, take it! Yes! Now you're staggering. Whoa! See, now I think he's again. Uh, he got a little bit angry now because I was going to town with him, and now he's even more angry now and has even more powerful attacks. But not if I can help it. Whoa! Jeez! You've been lifting, son. Uh oh! Oh, camera is freaking out. Camera is freaking out. <gasps> oh gosh, I'm freaking out. No, 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 no. Stay there. Stay there. Come on. You don't want to follow, follow me. Follow the other guy. Uh, some other guy. Oh, my God. All right. And there's this. This is very funny when you jump and when you start attacking, you're kind of hovering there, uh, which is, I guess, neat for like juggle combos and stuff like that, which you can, which I saw previously in the previous video where I was fighting all the. Um, 30 or 50 or uh, 1000 orcs uh, in the previous mission. And this is their big daddy, I guess, their, their uh, king. Oops. Get out of here. Drink another potion. Come on, dude. I don't want to live anymore. It's over soon. It won't be long now. Whoa, yes, I did it, I did it. <gasps> I was so shocked. So that's kind of like the first basic uh, big monster, kind of like the great Jaggy of this game. And uh, that's what he looks like. Yes, quest cleared. I know, I'm awesome. <laughs> like Monster Hunter, there is this um, thing where there's the countdown to return to... Um, 
to the um, village. And that's kind of like weird because for Monster Hunter you use this to carve, but you know, there's no corpse or anything. I can't carve in this game, so why there's a, even a countdown? That's kind of weird, isn't it? Uh, again, you know, uh, it's, it's different. It's very different. And um, if you have uh, extra income and if you're really, really uh, aching for some kind of uh, an action-based slash game, hack and slash game, and something that vaguely resembles Monster Hunter, then this might be interesting to check out. Check out also maybe my other recording, my other mission, and of course the wonderful long discussion with Brad Galway to um, hear more about what I think about this game. See you then, bye bye!